There's been so much chat about what India will do at the World Cup. 1.4 billion Indians scarred um, on the 19th of November. <laughs> Is there a soothing balm on offer at the end of this all? Um, at the World Cup, India, the squad going in with Rohit and Virat, the two big guns. Chehel is back in the squad. India going with uh, Bumrah and Sirat, the two paces. Hardik Pandya, the lone pace bowling all round in the side. The return of Rishabh Pant, Sanju Samson, and Shivam Dubey rewarded for their IPL form. Uh, all bases covered, Joy? I think it is. And you know, in the beginning, I was a bit worried because Rohit is captaining it. And I think what happens if Rohit is captaining it is you have Rohit and Virat have to play in the top three. Yeah. And you know, that may, they probably have to open as well. So around that, they balance you, setting the balance of the side. But now if you're thinking about it, if you look at the kind of pitches, maybe the, uh, the US pitches may be faster. Okay. But the West Indian pitches, if they're slower, okay, 170, 180 kind of totals is Virat is the master. Yeah. There's nobody better than him in the world to play those yeah. conditions. And Rohit will adapt pretty well as well. So I think that extra experience that India has, which I was looking at it as a disadvantage if they were playing on absolutely flat tracks, because they, you know, those guys will not go at 180, 200 like maybe an Abhishek or a Jaiswal would. But I think if you're batting at 140, 150, this is the right Indian batting side. So I'm in good call to go in with the big guns and does this side have all bases covered? I think they have the spin bowlers, the best spin bowling department in the tournament. Uh, and, and that is what I just mentioned before. You know, that's what's going to win you this tournament, I think. And in, in the latter part of it in particular, down in the Caribbean as it gets warmer. Um, and they have, got, they have that covered. I was a little surprised when Rinku Singh didn't get picked. I thought... That, that lack of real finishing power that he provides and his form through the IPL wasn't quite good enough and that's the reason for leaving him out. But quality spinners, batters that can almost guarantee you between 180 and 200 and if they have a great day, more, I think it's got a lot of bases covered. India is, of course, uh, the blockbuster side. It really gets bums on seats, but uh, from a cricketing logic point of view, is there a weakness in this squad and one player to watch out for? Well, I've always uh, looked up to Surya Kumar as uh, one player to watch out for because, in my opinion, he's the best T20 batter in this in this format at this point of time right. in world cricket. So, I'm going to back him and I want him to see at number three position, no matter what uh, batting order they choose up front. But most likely, if they go with uh, Virat and Rohit up, up opening slot, then... Obviously, I'll go with Surya Kumar Yadav. I think missing link would be Rinku Singh. Obviously, the selector and the captain did uh, mention in the interview that he had done nothing wrong. It's just that uh, uh, somehow it didn't fit in. But I completely agree that the finishing power of Rinku might have helped to secure the 100% guarantee of India reaching the finals and lifting the trophy. I mean, look, it's uh, it's difficult to look beyond Surya Kumar Yadav, uh, you know, just because he's just such a dominating influence. And I think... If you look at it, you know, even in the IPL, he scored more than, scoring more than 500 runs, batting at number four. I mean, at that position to bat and get those kind of runs, he's just unique. And I think he's he's a game changer. He's not going to come off in every match, but I think India understands that. They're steadier batters. But the day he comes off, he'll finish the match. Boom, 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 bro. Uh, look, I mean, it's going to be a tough tournament, I think, at times for the quick bowlers. But he's got every base covered as far as bowling is concerned. New ball, old ball, slower balls, Yorkers, you name it, he's got it. He will be the bowler of the tournament or the quick bowler of the tournament for me.